You guys have been asking for an up-to-date guide on how to make your Android look clean and minimalist like this. That is exactly what we're gonna do today. By the end of this video, your phone will look just like mine and it'll be way more functional than your current phone. And if that wasn't enough, I'll even show you a few extra tricks in case you wanna customize yours in your own way. Now, the very first step also happens to be the easiest. Let's get you an insanely clean wallpaper. Now, the stock Android wallpapers aren't bad, but to get to the level of this home screen, we're just gonna need something better. So of course, I'm gonna show you exactly how to get my wallpaper, but I'll also show you how to get a giant library of other cool backgrounds just in case you like one of those better. Now, do not fall into this one trap. When picking a background, always remember clean is king. Your apps are gonna go on top of this wallpaper, so if the wallpaper is too complex, it's just gonna look like a mess. Go for something minimalist. So first, head over to the Google Play Store and download the Zedge app. After you open it, you're gonna be overwhelmed with tons of insanely awesome wallpapers. Now, the one I ended up selecting was by the artist Sad SXN, but don't be afraid to pick up something else if it's more your style. The selection here is super awesome. By the way, I dropped tons and tons of videos on how you can level up the aesthetic of your tech. So drop a sub if you don't want to miss out on the new ones. And then once you find the wallpaper you like, just download it and press set wallpaper. Step number two, let's get you a custom icon pack. This step is also pretty easy. Now a custom icon pack is going to give your phone a consistent theme and really just make everything look way cleaner. And trust me, you don't want to just leave the default icons because they actually have a ton of variation between the sizes and colors. And it can just look kind of sloppy. Now, the important thing to remember is you don't need to spend any money on this step or in anything in this video. There are hundreds of icon packs on the Google Play Store that are 100% free and super high quality. So here, I'm just going to cover the free ones. But if you see one for like $3 or something and you really like it, at the end of the day, it's your phone. So just do whatever you like best. Now, the pack I'm currently using is called Arcticons. It's a simple and clean black icon pack. But in case you want to look at other options, here are 11 free, super high quality icon packs to consider. June. Juno, Zwart, Voxel, Monoic White Minimal, Arcticons, Viral, Lines, Aura, Moonshine, Flight Dark, Delta Icon Pack, and Unicorn Icon Pack. Now, once you've got your icon pack in mind, go ahead and search for it on the Google Play Store. Once you find it, select it and press install. From here, it's quick and easy to actually get these icons on your home screen. All you gotta do is download your favorite launcher. Mine is Nova Launcher and it's free. Then open up Nova Settings, Look and Feel, Icon Theme, and select your new icon pack. Now, once you finish that, step, you have a beautiful and minimalist home screen. But let's take one final step to upgrade this even further. Let's add a custom widget. Now to add a custom widget, you'll just need one more free app. And this one's called KWGT. Head over to the Google Play Store and download it and also download Feast KWGT. Now, once you've done that, we can actually add the widget. Now, remember, this is the widget I picked, but you can pick any widget you feel like. And there's going to be a ton to select from. To add it to the screen, tap and hold your home screen and then scroll down to add a KWGT blank widget. Resize it like this on your home screen and then tap it. Now scroll all the way down to V67 and tap that too. And the final result is pretty dope, I have to say. It is a ton of work, but the difference between this and the default home screen is not even in the same universe. Enjoy bragging to your friends that their home screen sucks. But I'm dropping an even more hype video I know you guys are gonna love next. Be sure to subscribe so you don't miss that. Thanks again for watching guys and see you in the next video.